All right, this is my supermarket. I'm heading home. Just bought some groceries. I don't know how much you can hear me, um, but I thought I'd do a little video. Well, I try to bike with one hand. Okay, we're going. <clears throat> All right, so this is where I take Japanese class up on like the eighth floor. Well, uh, All right, I don't want to die. <laughs> Uh, but I want you to see my, my bike ride. Um, I wish I had like a better way to uh, hold the camera while I'm biking. That's where I usually park my bike when I go to Japanese class. Just got home deck because I'm riding in the middle of the road. If I die, it's your fault. Hopefully I don't. stand here so I'm not gonna talk too much. Uh, so traffic. It's about a 10 minute bike ride. Well give or take like this traffic light obviously I'm not moving so it's um it'll be longer because I'm waiting here. That building is under construction. It's pretty overcast day. Second day of spring <laughs> March 22nd here. 2019 as you know it's kind of not cool I could technically go down that way because I'm gonna cross the street but I usually wait here because this lights bigger I don't know just you know my daily life Japanese class was okay it was the last day of Japanese class so we're changing teachers um, next oh next week we don't have class and then I'll have a different teacher next week that's kind of a shame I liked my teacher this year I only had it for like six months, so... Oh well. No, this is... I must have just missed the light, because this is... taking forever. It's already been two minutes, jeez. Sorry, it's the most boring video I've ever seen in your life. Daily life in Japan. If I was gonna like edit this for like YouTube, I would definitely cut this part out. But you must suffer. I sound like a crazy person talking to myself now. Alright, there we go. And we're just gonna cut across. Please don't hit me, truck. Alright, well, it'd probably be easier if I was holding the phone with my left hand and biking with my right hand. But that would just make too much sense, wouldn't it? Convenience store. This is the other side of the school. Maybe don't hit me. Child walking home. Oh, his mom. Lots of cute little houses along here. In June or July, we had a big earthquake. And this fence right here, as you can see, used to be like a stone wall. And they've changed all of those. Or they're changing the wall right now. It used to look kind of like this stone wall right here. And one of them fell and killed a nine-year-old girl. So everywhere around here you've seen them tearing them down and putting up those kind of clear see-through fences. Which is really nice because you can't you can't see through the cinder block ones. So they were kind of dangerous just in general. That used to be a house. And now they are those kind of metal fences so you can see through them. There's a spot up ahead that I'll try to show you. It used to be a big cinder block wall. It was really dangerous. And now it's one of those metal ones so you can actually see through it. Already breathing hard. I'll try to, I know you don't want to see the road in front of me. I'll try to keep it to the side so you can see some of these interesting houses. And this is the route that I always take to Japanese class. Sometimes to the train station. There's a slightly more direct route, but this one's not on a main street, so it feels a little bit safer. I hope you can hear me, it's pretty windy. <clears throat> if you can't, then just mute the video, enjoy the ambiance of the, of the vi visuals. This was also another big building that was torn down, that one too. This one's been torn down for a while now. A little tunnel we're gonna go through. So romantic. Alright, another building that's been torn down. 
lots of buildings are always being torn down and rebuilt. And you'll notice a lot of these buildings have like blue tarps on the top. That's also from the earthquake and the typhoon. Oh, here comes the car. Get out of his way. Sorry. <sighs> Lots of roads are very, very narrow, as you will probably see. It's a post office right here. Definitely just missed that light. Pretty sure this building was destroyed in the um, in the earthquake. There used to be a place here, and it's all boarded up now. I switched hands just now, so hopefully, I can bike a little easier. In a way, this is kind of a fun video for me too, because someday I'm not going to live here, and my memory is so shit that I'm going to forget what happened. So this way I can maybe someday watch this back. Looks like maybe something new has moved in there, actually. There's a sign there. It's covered right now, but it says Natsumoto Toshiaki. That's just a person's name, though. <laughs> well, whatever. Looks like maybe they're going to open something that's kind of nice. Oh, green light. Let's go. Okay. It's extra hard to bike right now. One, because I'm only using one hand. But two, because I got all these groceries in my basket. And some of them, I got a jar of pickles. Because, man, pickles are hard to find here. And, like, a bunch of cans of, like, coffee. So, it's extra heavy. Including my own fat ass. There's a mini stop. It's kind of a shame, like, sometimes this area is much prettier when it's a little greener and flower, more flowers. But, it's not too bad. I figured I wanted to do this when it wasn't summer, because when it's summer I don't want to even move. Oh, there's another house with a bunch of stuff on top. This is a 100 yen loss, and it's like a convenience store, grocery, but everything is pretty much 100 yen, except for the stuff that's not 100 yen. You have to be careful. There used to be a place there too, and it's closed. This is like a little elementary school, or I think actually it's a kindergarten. Probably not going to see any. Oh, there's some kids up there. I'm gonna be the creepy guy, the creepy white guy, filming the kids as I bike past. Okay, don't be too creepy. <laughs> Look at that little garden and stuff though. You can see that. And to your left is, this is a, a junior high, I think. It's still a big wall. I like this fence used to be a, a cinder block wall. And it is now this like fence. I guess this one won't fall down as easily. There's a truck in front of us. Uh, today is like the last day of a lot of people. There's an Amazon distribution center. So there's a lot of schools letting out earlier, graduations happening. We have a light again. We have caught every single light. Oh, this is the wall. Uh, you can see the bottom half is still cinder blocks. It used to be all cinder blocks. So if you're waiting on that corner, trying to turn left or right or go straight, could very easily get crunched by like this lady coming here. So now you can actually see it, which is great. If you go that direction, that's the main street, which is how I would get to the. If you go that way, uh, that's how to get to the train station or like the mall. I'm gonna go see a movie or something. My house is this way, though. Good exercise. Should have turned my uh, fitness tracker on. I did not. Actually, I actually don't know if I can video while that's running, actually. So, it was better that I didn't. How are you? <laughs> Looks like it's going to rain today. In fact, it already did rain today, so I don't know what I'm saying. Alright, this bump is always really, really high, so I gotta go over it slow. I have definitely lost my groceries going over that bump too fast. Okay. There's probably a spot where I'm gonna have to actually get off and walk my bike too, because normally I can take the hill, but with one hand, I'm trying to 
now with all these groceries, probably can't. So, you'll get to see it. But I would say we're about halfway home. I just look about halfway. It's already been 10 minutes. We're going slower. Look at these houses. That's been destroyed. And there was totally a house right there that they just took down like two weeks ago. This is another high school. You can see these orange fence is where those cinder blocks were. And they haven't put in those other fences yet. So that's kind of interesting. And this is a high school. Let's see a sign. Oh. Lots of apartment complexes. Oh, it's so windy today. It's hard to bite against the wind. You can see it's starting to get a little more rural out this way, though. This is a big rice field right here. Not a big one, but it is a rice field. Obviously, no rice growing right now. let some mice go over here to the left in this little field but only two all right here's our little tunnel so it's really low you might want to duck while we're in here all right full steam power okay i made it these are all two-way roads by the way well, maybe you can't sell these line like this text on the floor here. That was facing that way, this is facing this way. Alright. This really sharp turn here. Alright, and this little tiny hill right here is the one I'm gonna probably have to walk up. I can do it, I don't have to walk it. Oh, we're gonna walk it. Another rice field. Just be a bunch of Lazy fat asses walk up this hill. Alright, well, it's not even easy to walk it with one hand. Okay. I did it though. Ha ha. See, there's a two cars going the opposite direction. And there's this guy's over here, like, he's pulled over. So that this car can go past. Here comes another guy too. It's always fun. Right. Get back on the bike. One moment, don't pull for more. I'm in total mud. They could have Okay. This is a river. It almost flooded one one time last year. It's not very full right now, as you can see. But I was glad that it's as deep as it is, because it was kind of scary. All of these are love hotels coming up, which is, you know, if you have three generations living in one house, like a 90-year-old grandma, a 50-year-old dad, and like a 25-year-old son, he takes his girlfriend here so they can fucking have babies. Deluxe room. So this one's called Swing. <laughs> this one is called Canon. Canon. And it plays um, Canon and Bell. You get close enough. And then my favorite is, uh, we, yes we can, which just happens to have the, the logo, which looks kind of like butt, kind of like boobs, depending on what you're into, I guess. And there's more there the other direction, but we're going to turn on this bridge here. Oh. As a matter of fact, since we're turning, we are not going to go past the mouse location, so, sorry. Look at all these roofs. All of these roofs have been damaged. Mine was damaged too, but my boss has already repaired it. Alright, it's another tunnel. This one's for cars, so we have to be especially careful. Alright, looks like we're clear. We'll steam ahead. You're going to see a little cemetery coming up on the right. They don't really bury their dead in Japan. So these are all just like grave markers. Usually they cremate them. Not usually, they always cremate them. Probably because, you know, they live on a tiny little island. Oh yeah, there's... That one has like Cinderella on the top. I don't know if you can see it. It's called White Chapel, I think. Oh no, that's White Story. I don't know. And then you have a bunch of like, industrial buildings over here. We're very close to my house. Maybe you recognize that building. I don't know. Almost there. It's been recording for f almost 15 minutes. Oh my 
I can't fucking hold it. I don't know. I guess I would have to upload this to YouTube or something. I don't know if I can send it over um, Google Hangout. Whew. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Playground is the one by my house, so we're gonna turn here. Somebody's oh, the children coming home from school. I don't usually come home this early, so. I'm creeping on the children, and this is the house. Yay!